gonna take you guys for a quick walk around the parking lot of this up garage right here and show you all the cool cars. It's pretty dope. Right over here, we've got somebody's super cool Liberty Walk Ferrari. Fitment is atrocious. They probably don't know how to ride low. Whatever, can't blame them. But right over here, super clean chaser. We've got a good one right here. I think you guys are gonna like this one. R34 just pulled up and parked. Pretty sure this is a GTT, but super clean regardless. We've got an RX-7 literally just chilling. Evo. This is literally normal here. It's nuts. What'd you get? Got myself a bride seat. Carbon fiber. Sweet, bro, how much? Carbon fiber, carbon fiber, uh, 600 bucks. Fire. Let's go. Fire. Yeah, I got an MD mirror too. You guys probably think we have this at home, but we actually don't. Check out what car this is. This is a Lavorg. There's also an STI model as well. It's literally an STI or WRX wagon. We've driven across like three parking lots already. This is ridiculous. Um, hop in. Let's go find another one. I guess uh, owning a Ferrari is just what it feels like, huh? Uh, just, just a white body Ferrari. Yeah, just a white body. So I think he has to buy another Ferrari. <laughs> you think we'll fit that one? Um, nope. Oh my god. This is look at look at this is ridiculous. There's no way for that one. This is a this is a two-way street and you're literally taking up both lanes. Other than the fact that parking is really hard to find, the car is amazing to drive. It's honestly really annoying though, driving through the neighborhoods. Oh, and also they have drop-offs. Look look how fat that freaking curb is. There's even fatter ones. I don't know how you even break. Oh, okay, here, 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 here we go, here we go. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nope, definitely not. No, right. definitely, no. Definitely not. Actually, that one might work. Am I clear? I'm not gonna go up the curb. You're good, just keep on going that way. Oh, yeah, I think you'll fit this, you'll fit this one. Okay, I have to reverse. All right. I gotta reverse it. So how many points you have to, how many? Probably like a 30 point turn if I go this way. Yeah. The car's turning radius is absolutely trash. Hopefully PBM comes out with the angle kit <laughs> for a Ferrari. <laughs> oh, slow down, slow down. What? You better go over the... Am I? Yes, stop, 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 stop. Okay, look at this. Bro, this car's too wide, bro. I can't see anything. Is this good? Yeah, you're good now. Yeah, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. It's a good, it's a good. You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. It's a good. Keep on going. Stop. Finally. This is every single time we have to park. Every single time. Guys, I think I'm gonna have to go find a different parking spot. Look poking out and I know for a fact that car has a really good chance of hitting this car. Uh, let's get out of here. Let's go find another parking spot. It's in a hit. It's in a hit. Oh. 
Can you go more? The rear has to go down. Okay, yeah. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Get down. Good. Perfect. Oh, a little bit, a little bit. Perfect. Look at that. Can you send me a ticket? Jesus. Hey, what's up? There you go, sir. Arigato gozaimasu. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. All right, I'm over having a Ferrari. Now we made it. What a mission, huh? Mission. Finally found parking. Dude, Kelvin, look how yeah. big it is and long it is compared to whatever this thing is. Um, actually, that's a Suzuki. <laughs> <laughs> No, actually, his car's bigger because he's taking two spots. <laughs> Not the Bailey, the drift car. <laughs> <laughs> Finally made it to Tokyo guys and we finally I officially bought my first apartment complex and this is my parking for the Ferrari check it out this whole apartment complex is mine let me take you guys inside for a little tour come on right now it's called the Genovia what should we call it lemonade uh, I'll watch a sky garden <laughs> yeah. let's go <laughs> What floor are we on again? Uh, we are on the top floor. We're on the 20th floor. Alright, let's try to... How do we go? Um, I didn't pay for the apartment yet. <laughs> we get stuck? We're, we're just kidding, guys. <laughs> we found the easiest parking we've ever found. And it's literally the coolest parking spot ever. This is the first time, huh? Yeah. <sighs> Alright, well, guys, we're gonna call it a night. We'll see you guys tomorrow. We're gonna take the Ferrari around and... Uh, have some fun in Japan. So that's Randy. There's a cop in front of his car. I think his Ferrari is making some noise. He's talking to her right now. So Randy's walking back. Right now, he just talked to the cop. 
I don't know what happened, but that beeping noise was causing a ruckus in this whole neighborhood. So what happened, huh? What happened? It's the Ferrari. I told you. <laughs> You're like, no, it's not <laughs> the Ferrari. No Bro, it sounded like an emergency, like like a, oh, like those warnings, like earthquake warnings. Hold on, uh, she wants my international driver. Uh oh, here we go. I don't know. Randy Trump uh, goes back to jail. Somebody called the police. Bro. Oh really? Oh. Yeah. Is she cool though? She's cool, huh? Uh, I don't know. I have no idea. She wants my license though. Okay. So um, I'll be right back. Okay. Let me know if you need it. But them. if she asks me about you, I don't know nothing. There you go. I don't know nothing. You ain't snitching, huh? I ain't snitching. Can you see the Ferrari right? Yeah, I can see it. I, 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 I was trying to film it. Did you hear the alarm? Yes. Did you get it on camera? Yes. Oh my god, it's so crazy. I was like, there's no way it's the Ferrari, right? I'm walking outside, it's like literally hella loud. I was like, there's no way it's the Ferrari. I unlocked the Ferrari. It turns off. I was like, I was like, okay, let me. And then I was like this, hold on, let me lock the car one more time. It went back on. I don't know what it is. Maybe battery? True. Okay, okay. Okay. Current update, Randy is giving his international driver's license to the cop let's see what happens oh shit i think he's getting arrested be right back guys don't run my pants down randy's good to go i guess he's free my boy is free he's running look at, look at him how happy he is he's running dude if i drop this camera we're on the 10th floor by the way if i drop this camera he'd be so mad but the cop is still there oh she's actually gone the fire doesn't clean all right time for b-roll in the shower. What happened? Huh? Sorry, I'm in the shower. Yeah, you're in the shower. Go, no, I'm. I'm you're still uh, in the shower. I was filming B-roll. <laughs> <laughs> I think somebody tried to break into the Ferrari. Oh, uh, what? Had money up. Wait. <laughs> yeah, somebody was trying to take the change in the Ferrari. So the police came and everything. Dude, it was going off for a good 30 minutes, bro. I think an hour. That's so funny. Whatever. Back at home, bro, the windows would have been smashed. Nah, your car, sure. your wheels have been gone. Car's gone. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get ready and get today. Let's started. go. Let's do it. That's so funny. Me and Kelvin were literally looking from the window right here, out at the Ferrari down the street. As the siren was going off, we're like, damn, this, the Ferrari's like hella popular. <laughs> like, they're taking pictures of it. Oh, people bringing legs, like, what the heck is this? But yeah, we're like, we're just standing in the window watching, like, damn, that, that's a sick car. Yeah. Turns out they were calling the police. <laughs> <laughs> Not me almost going to jail. <laughs> Here's another downside to having uh, a Liberty Walk Ferrari, though, is uh, this damn lip collects all this water. Uh, Ferrari is still safe. Let's go grab some sushi. You want to hear how loud it really is? I guess it doesn't work now. More shit. All of a sudden, huh? All of a sudden, the alarm doesn't want to turn on. There you go. Here. Now your car won't open. Now my car. So that that was the noise. Oh, dude, that's hella loud. Here comes the cop again. Just get. <laughs> But that noise, we heard it from all the way up there. I'm actually very curious to see how much parking costs for this VIP spot right here. Those crows sound crazy here in Japan, huh? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's it. 1,600 yen is equivalent to, check this out, if you guys don't know, 1,600 yen converted to US dollars. $11.87. Not bad. Not bad at all. You can also pay by visa in certain areas as well. Good to go. Anything for the shot. 
Jinx, you owe me a house. Jinx, you owe me a gun. Jinx, you owe me a kid. I love, love Japan. Japan. Bro, Bro, how do you keep doing, doing that? that? I fucking love, love you, dog. You, dog. <laughs> <laughs> questions that I cannot answer. That's a great answer. Let's just keep doing it until we get pulled over, yeah? All right. You know what? Let's do a side show right now. Let me get out. Yo. <laughs> are we sliding? Or are we, we hiding? hiding? <laughs> get back or, or get, get smacked. <laughs> you said going faster. You said go faster. You said get back and get smacked. <laughs> just so you guys know, I don't drive like that the entire time. You're right. <laughs> I don't. You're right. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Well, <laughs> oh, I guess I, I do, kind of. But because we're vlogging, just give you guys a little extra sauce. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Complaining, by the way, I absolutely love this car. I just want to show you guys the inconveniences of owning a super wide car. In today's video, I realized I was trying my best to not be an asshole, but you know what? We're driving the most obnoxious car in Japan, so I say, send it. The crazy thing is, we're going the freaking speed limit, bro. We just hit 50 kilometers, which is equivalent to 30 miles an hour. This car is way louder than it sounds, like on camera. And it's even louder when you're following behind in another car. It took us a while, but we found parking for the Rari. And as you guys can tell, it doesn't fit. I don't know if we'll get a ticket or not. We'll find out when we get back, yeah? Ready for some sushi? Yes, sir. Today, guys, I'm taking Kelvin to Kura Sushi, one of my favorite sushi places. It's cheap, it's quick, and um, it's on a conveyor belt. Yep. So, you ready? You ready. Check this out guys, um, they have like their basic sushi, 
on the conveyor belt, but you can actually go onto here and order all their other premium sushi. We ordered a bunch of stuff already, and the premium stuff comes up. But what's cool is, check this out. Once you're done with your sushi, mm -hmm. sayonara. And it counts how many plates you have. Once you get 15 plates, you get a prize. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I don't care for the prize. I already have the prize. You. Aww. My Thank man. You Love you. <laughs> I hope no one saw that. <laughs> oh, here you go. Let's go. I got this for us. We share one. We didn't film all of the food we ate, but the total after getting 15 plus orders for both of us is around $40. How nuts is that? Back at home, how much did you think it would be? 80. 80? Like double. Honestly, even up to 100. And we got like signature stuff. We got like multiple drinks. This is very cheap. Yep. All right, Kelvin. Kuda Sushi, out of 10. Eight. Eight. Yeah, I'd give it an eight too. If you want really, really good sushi and you're willing to spend more money, you know, go for it. But I think Kuda Sushi, perfectly priced. Honestly, I think it's below like, Below perfectly priced, sure. I and mean, it's free for me, so <laughs> can't complain. Hey, hey. Pays to be funny, right? Oh, for sure. Thanks for helping me on Thank today's you. vlog, bro. Thank you. Fit check, fit check. What you rocking? What you rocking with? Look, chromie. Okay, okay. Look, Louis bag. I see you. I see you. Um, purple denim. Okay, okay. Air Force One. I know. Who can Air Force One, man? You know what I mean? Bust down. <laughs> Ooh, no, man, keep busting down. <laughs> what time is it? The rollie on my, not on my wrist. <laughs> not yet, not yet. Not yet, soon, yeah. coming soon, coming soon. Oh, wrong way, this way. Oh, shit. <laughs> no, your car was parked right here. You towed it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm low-key kind of lost, but it's cool. Getting lost in Japan, if you know absolutely zero Japanese, it's okay, because a lot of stuff here, like a lot of signs here are in English, and also the maps will literally show you where to go and it's so easy to navigate around all you got to do is get lost like two to three to four times like i did and then you're a pro we hey, we don't get lost anymore right no i don't think we this trip we haven't that's a different story honestly that's kind of confusing like the toll is left and right it's so quick so you have to and if you miss it you have to make it you, like, it's not even you you gotta loop all the all way around. around you gotta pay another toll dude yeah you have to pay extra and guess what? We found the Ferrari. And guess what? You got a ticket. Let's see if we, let's see if we got a ticket. You got a ticket? You're good? Wait, I don't know if the... We're good. How do you guys like it? <laughs> thank you. Thank you. If you come to Japan too, your Instagram will thank you because literally... All right, guys, ready? Turn your phones with me. Look at that. Right there, that's already an Instagram picture. Being a content creator in Japan is like literally the easiest thing. Do you know why? Why? It's because, look bro, everything about Japan is just so beautiful. The food, just anything. It's all new, it's fresh. It's the people. The people like you. At least for the car enthusiast, it's the perfect place to create content. Sucks we gotta go home, huh? Sucks. It's cool though, we can come back again. Yes sir. That's nuts. Never in my life did I think that we'd be doing this in another country. <laughs> Stop! Before you get your boner full, <laughs> Stop! I never thought I'd be doing that too. <laughs> you guys don't understand how nice some of the people are here in Japan. That's the worker from the gas station leading me in the correct way.
put a towel so it doesn't scratch the paint. <laughs> At certain gas stations, they will pump your tank for you. All you have to say if you want a full tank is manda. 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 That means full tank. So the manda. So the manda. No, uh, but uh, here you say mantan onigaishimas, which is full tank, please. And uh, on the side over here, they even have, you know, stuff to clean your cars and for yourself. You can take a bath. Shout out to Yokohama. So I'm gonna, I paid five bucks for this. I'm gonna take a shower. <laughs> <laughs> We're just kidding, guys. We don't know what that's for. How much do you think it's gonna cost for a full tank in USD? for the Ferrari. 60 bucks. 60? Okay. I've already done many full tanks. So okay. let's see if right. you win. All right. So how, but how, $60 in USD, how much is that in yen? 60, I'd like to say around 8,000 yen. Oh, eight. Okay. <laughs> Kelvin already got to learn this, but what's another cool thing that these guys do when you come and pump gas? They fill it up for you and they, they wipe your windows down. They'll wipe your windows down for free and they'll even clean your dash yeah. for you. Yes. And one thing with Japan is they do not accept tip here as well. Uh, uh, not at all. Yeah. How nice are they? Oh, thank you, thank you. How nice is that? How nice. That's actually my first time ever experiencing that. Don't expect everybody to be that nice here, but the majority of people are super cool. I had the Ferrari washed um, my last trip here. Bro, he did the best car wash. Cost me 20 USD. Dude, I felt so bad, bro. And you tried giving him tip, remember? I asked if I could give him a tip because I just felt bad. But here in this country, tipping is, it's just not a part of the culture. Like they refuse to take it. And if you even leave like five yen at the toll, the guy will come out and chase you. I forgot my money and he's like, Choto mate. He literally ran all the way to catch up to me, which is nuts. We finally got a full tank, baby. All right, guys, I think this is it for today's vlog. Kelvin and I are gonna go park the Ferrari. We're gonna go take the train and just not worry about parking anymore because there's a lot of situations where I didn't film us parking the Ferrari because you guys obviously get the point, right? Um, other than the fact that there are a few inconveniences, there are also a lot of pros as well. Like driving around in this car, literally just breaking necks and just seeing kids on the street smile. <laughs> people just love this car. There are people that actually hate the car too though. Of course. Yeah, it's kind of obnoxiously loud. But with the click of a button, you know, we can turn that off. But guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. The next video, we're gonna take this car around Shibuya, Shinjuku area, and uh, you guys will have to find out the rest. I'll see you guys later. Kelvin, thanks for helping me on today's video. No problem. Thank you. If you guys enjoyed this video, go down, like, comment, subscribe. Peace.